Hello. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Amanda, otherwise known as the Tangle Skeins Crafter on YouTube. Um, today I have a little bit of a different video for you. I have a collaboration coming up with 7th grade, but I do not have the items yet, so I can't do an unboxing. But they're having a Black Friday sale, and I was afraid you would miss out if I waited until I received the product. So today we're just going to click around on the site, see what they have for all of you that haven't been to 7great.com before. If you have, then I mean, at least now you know that they have a big sale going on for Black Friday. All right, let's see what they have, which I have been on their site before, obviously, and I really like their items. Looks like they have this little pop up. It says special offer. You save five dollars if you buy fifty dollars. Five dollars. These are all in USD. Um, six dollars by sixty-six. So, you know, on up. All right. Up here it shows that their Black Friday sale is twenty percent off with the code twenty-three Black Friday twenty. You can just copy the code and you will paste it in your cart at the end. Let's see. Start with what's new. So this is going to show all their new arrivals for their cross stitch. Oh, I think I might have to put this in my wish list. Look how cute these kittens are in an umbrella. Okay, I'm going to try not to sit here and just drool over all the products. I'm going to try to do a quick little walkthrough of their site. Oh, they have some really pretty ones though. The prices are reasonable. Odd puppy. More dead air. John Wayne. I grew up with John Wayne. And I would not mind doing a John Wayne cross stitch. I'm not sure where I would hang it if I hang, hung it up on my wall, but it's just good memories, good childhood memories of John Wayne. Watching it with my grandmother. Bees. I love bees. I oh, love little chipmunks and hats. This. I've been looking at this on several different sites. This is gorgeous. I'm very tempted to get it. It's just if I get another Christmas one, then I'm going to want to do it for Christmas. And I already have multiple ones planned. So it's going to have to wait, I think. Maybe next year. All right, well, you can see what kind of stuff they have. They have Joy Sunday. I still have not got a Joy Sunday kit that I'm aware of. I haven't looked through all my old kits yet, but I really want to try a Joy Sunday kit since I see a lot of people doing them and they turn out so well. Let's see what's under their top sellers. These come in so handy. I use these and lose these constantly. Oh, that's a cute little dream catcher. I still haven't tried these. If anybody has tried these, let me know if they actually come out of the fabric because I'm, I'd am like to kind of grid some of my counted ones because I'm getting really used to stamped and um, I'm scared to use these. Oops. Oh, I love this image. 50 by 41 and she's only, she's less than $10. That is tempting. needles. I see this a lot and I love Santa Claus. Christmas and Halloween are my two favorite holidays and Christmas probably is my favorite when it comes to images like cross stitch and stuff. Floss holders. Cross stitch storage presentation book. Let's click on that because I haven't seen one of these. Does it show what the inside looks like? Does it have just like a bunch of like, yes. All right. I think I've seen something like a similar like this anyway for diamond painting also. I might have to get me some of these because right now I, I just have them stuck willy nilly here and there in boxes and stuff. The ones I have, I haven't framed anything yet and I don't have a, a whole lot finished. But the ones I do, they're just kind of rolled up and stuck in random places. 
big size, which is my favorite size across stitch. I like things that take me forever. And these call to my heart. Eventually I'm going, there's a whole series of these and eventually I am going to have all of them done, trained, and hung on my library wall whenever I have a library, which I'm supposed to have someday when my husband builds me a house. TMI. There will probably be TMI all through this because that is what I do. I talk too much. Just realized I've been recording and I'm not sure if it's actually recording. Oh, well, I'm using my voice recorder too though, so that should be picking up everything. I love this house. Halloween Black Lodge 60 by 60. That is going to go into my wish list. See, there's more. I like the books. I just, I don't know, I love these long ones. Girl Who Reads. I want them all over my wall. And more Christmas. I'm just drawn to Christmas. I saw another lady on YouTube doing this one and I love it. Harry Potter. I've seen this before. Oh, look at that one. And dragons. Dragons. I love dragons so much. Looney Tunes, another childhood memory. Where are the books that I want? If my husband happens to watch this, these are great Christmas ideas. And look, you would save 20% off with their Black Friday sale. Alright, let's look at their half price. This one, I keep looking at this one. I've seen this on a few sites. This is the best price, of course, because it is on sale that I've seen for this size, 40 by 50. This one, I really love this one. I almost bought this one. But I'm trying not to spend much money right now because Christmas is coming up and I'm the only one that does cross stitch. No one else in my family does. So I can't just keep buying stuff for myself. I have to buy stuff for other people. So maybe after Christmas, some of these will still be around. I doubt it. They're really beautiful. I'm sure they're all going to be sold. Look at this. Look how pretty she is. The real flower fairy. Alright, let's see what they have under their Joy Sunday brand. I do love this one. I've looked at it often. Let's go by low to high and see how, what they have in the lower. <laughs> Any cute. These are really pretty. These like flowers, just like, I don't know how I'd describe it. It's almost like um, whenever you like, take a mi microscope and zoom in on stuff or take a section out of something. It's what it makes me think of. But these are just really pretty and really colorful. I love this one, 53 by 22. Look, it's only $3.17 USD. Oh, it's so tempting. I'm ena enabling myself by showing you all this sale. Because this is a good sale. 20% off. And it doesn't say anything about a limit or anything. It's just 20% off. And of course, the more you buy, the more you're going to save. Some Halloween. Oh, they have beautiful Halloween ones. I actually have this picture up on my blog. Oh, I love the flowers on this pumpkin. Oh, and look at this one. Look how pretty that is. And of course there's cute ones. Look at the kitten. And look at that kitten. And we have a nice little Disney one. Look at the little like Mickey Mouse ghosts. And Mickey Mouse pumpkins. I hope I'm allowed to say Mickey Mouse on here because I just did. Nightmare Before Christmas is one of my absolute favorite cartoons. When it comes to just how it looks. 
Whoops. I'm using this mouse way too much. There's another one. I think these cupcakes are adorable. I keep seeing different cross stitch um, sets with kits, I guess, with or just patterns also, charts in random places with cupcakes, decorated cupcakes for all the different holidays. I just cannot talk today. Words. I really hope this is recording well. I really, look at these. Tell me these aren't gorgeous. It's autumnal and it's, it's just, it's chests. I love chests. I don't know why this is making me think of Harry Potter. It's not, but it's what it made me think of. More cute Halloween kittens. Yeah, I have this. I think I have this as a diamond painting. I'm going to do probably next year, obviously. So it's, let's look at the Christmas before I get on a, a weird ramble about it. Joy Sunday Christmases. These are adorable. You know there's going to be a lot of backstitching. Oh, the Grinch. Oh, and they have stockings. I have got to do some cross-stitch stockings. I have some kits already at home. Well, at home, that's where I am. But I have some kits already that I have not even started for stockings. This one, I just saw someone unbox this. I cannot remember who it was. If I remember, I'll put her name up. It was, you know, here on YouTube, but I love this. It's so colorful and just so Christmassy. And these would make a nice pair on a wall. The same but different, you know, same vibe. I have this. I've had this one for years and I think I started one of the owls. I really need to get that out and work on it next month, hopefully for the next acrostic. These are, some of these are really good prices. I'm sure all of them are, but just compared to what I've seen. Oh, it's 16 count. 38 by 28. What was this one up here? This was 11 count. I'm getting really addicted to 11 count, but 16 count would be really nice too. And not as big if you're not wanting as big of a piece. Oh, and look how gorgeous that is. Good prices plus 20% off for their Black Friday big sale. Don't forget about that code. Which I'll put that code in the description box so you won't forget about it. Stained glass is one of my favorite things to do. I just find it very pretty. I hope to have some kind of, I know they're expensive, so I don't want to dream too much, but I hope to have some kind of stained glass window in one of my rooms in my future house. Because they're just gorgeous. I think I'll be doing this one soon. Look for it in a future unboxing. I love stuff like this. If you wanted to, you could make these separate little pieces and frame them in little small frames or make them into the little, like the little stand up, the little like trifold stand up. I don't know what they're called, but I'm picturing it. You know, you just kind of unfold it and stand it up on a shelf. I love these trees. Let's see, under cross stitch they have, oh look, they have Harry Potter, Angels and Cherubs, Flower and Garden, Religious and Inspirational, Words and Phrases, Baby and Children, Family and Love, Animal and Insects. That's interesting. Cartoon and Characters, Landscape and Town. Let's look under Cartoon and Characters. Okay, some of them that we've seen. Love that. I love bookshelves. This one is on my wish list on several sites, and that is not a bad price. And then the 20% off would make that even cheaper. That is very tempting. Like I said, I got to stop looking for myself. I'm here to show you what is available during this sale. I love Harry Potter inspired pieces. I loved those books. I read them all and I've watched all the movies and I own all the movies and I have I have merchandise. 
I have wands, I have posters, I have I have ornaments on my tree. Oh, I'm doing this piece right now. So I think this might be bigger than what I'm doing. So probably better. But who knows? Totoro, love Totoro. Mickey Mouse. I can't even tell you how much I love Mickey Mouse. Again, childhood memories. My children didn't really grow up watching Mickey Mouse much. They weren't as enthralled with him as I was. Totoro, I think I, I'm, I think I have this piece and I'm getting ready to start it. I have it, yeah, it's counted. Let's look. Low to three. Let's look from... Let's look for, at some of the more expensive ones from 20. Sailor Moon. I like these. Let me click on it. Oh, my cat's coming to visit. One of my cats. One, two. Does it come in one, two, three, four, five pieces? Five panels, yes. Whoops, I didn't mean to flip to another part. That would be really pretty on a wall. 130 by 61. Eleven count. Comes with everything you need, obviously. Except for the frames. Because I would definitely be framing these. Or maybe wrapping them around flat canvas panels. And hanging them on the wall that way. That would be really pretty. Alright, let's go back my husband once upon a time. Anyway, that one's really cute. Really heartfelt, happily ever after. There's flowers, there's peacocks. Someone I watch on YouTube loves peacocks. This one I've looked at so many times. Is that not gorgeous? I really like this too. That's really cute. Another panel one. Oh look, they sell a, uh, the, the hoop stand holder thing. <laughs> words. Apparently they have blind boxes. You can get one piece, three piece, or five piece. Let's see, you don't know what you're going to get. They're all individually packaged. It's the best gift to yourself. It really is. It doesn't say what sizes you'd get, but I mean five pieces for $23.99 and then you get the 20% off until the end of November. I think that is, is that in addition to this or separate from this? I'm not sure if that's stackable or not. It'd be worth trying because $23.99 minus 20% and then maybe another 20% off would be wonderful. And who knows, you could get all kinds of cool stuff in that box. Let's move on to tools because this video is already getting kind of long for me just clicking around on a website. You got those gorgeous little threaders. Oh, I really like that one. Thread cutters, which I have some of these and they come in really handy. You can thread it on a necklace just so you can have it with you all the time if you want or on a keychain. I just have mine laying on my desk. I think they're kind of pretty. This is the one I have. The Red Ancient. They have a phone holder. They have the square hoops. I still call them Q-snaps even though I know that's a brand name and not what those are called. It's got everything you could need. Bobbins, plastic bobbins. Pink, blue, white, hunter peas. Floss cards, everything you could possibly need to do your cross stitch with. Your needle minders. And look, some of them are really cute. Double-sided tape. I'm not sure what you need that for with cross stitch, but I'm sure something. Maybe it helps you frame. Your clips, which I think I just ordered myself some because I've lost most of mine. Thimbles. Needles. Cute scissors. I want a pair of these. Again. If anybody in my family is watching this that wants to buy me something for Christmas. Scissors are never turned away. All colors are welcome. All shapes are welcome. 
Look how cute they are. Look at those. European style. Pretty. Are those squirrels? Those are so cute. Floss cards. Pin cushion. A rectangle hoop. Elastic bandage cross tube. This makes me think of the stuff they put around my arm whenever they do blood tests. I could see how that would come in handy. It's like a little thimble or something. Instead of wearing an awkward thimble. Winding boards, I guess, the bobbins. Along with the storage box. I want to go to the next page. I mean, they just have all kind of nifty stuff. It's one of those little crochet rings that you can put your yarn through and it helps keep the tension. Magnifier loop, but glasses. I need a pair of those. Even with my readers, I can barely see what I'm doing sometimes. Look at this cute little storage box with the little pin cushion on top. There's you a, it says thread, but thread, the threader, beeswax holder, what cloth. I've never done punch needle, but I've always been interested in it. Some sewing thread. It says polyester sewing machine yarn line box. So I guess it's like what you sew with in a sewing machine, but you can use it for embroidery. More bobbins, more clamps, beeswax, another beeswax holder. I have one of these and this thing is great. I love it, especially for my counted. Magnetic sticker art craft fridge. Looks like a little cross stitch magnet. I don't know if you cross stitch it yourself or if it just looks like cross stitch. It looks like you, it just, yeah, it just looks like cross stitch. It's really cute though. More thimbles. Garment clips with bandage. You know, I think that people use this on their scroll frames to keep the tension. I think. I've seen something like this on someone's channel. More of these. This one's a 50 hole. This one's a 30 hole. More, more of your needle threaders. Ah, oh, these are gorgeous. I want this one. And this one. And I definitely want this one. Yeah, this is just in enabling me. Magnifying desk. It says lamp. Is it a lamp or just magnifying? Maybe it takes batteries. You know, a little magnifying desk lamp that clamps on the side of the desk. Broider crochet handmade craft household sewing supplies. I'm not sure what that is. Is it like, is it like punch needle? If anybody knows what this is, please tell me in the comments. Kind of makes me think of like a tiny little latch hook. No, it's just a little crochet needle. I'm really not sure what that's for. So if anybody knows, please tell me. It looks kind of like maybe punch needle. I don't know how punch needle works. So I try not, not to sound dumb in my, or I should say ignorant in my videos, but what I don't know, I don't know. I have a lunchbox with this exact pattern on it. That's funny. I would like to have one of these. So I guess, does this one come with stuff or is it just bigger? Let me look. Mm, it just says storage bag. 32 by 30 by 6. Thirty-five by thirty-five by eleven. I'm confused. So is this bigger but cost less? I'm not sure. Anyway, oh, they have some plain color ones. I really like this one because I love purple. It's my favorite color. They can buy hundred colors of cotton floss. I have something like this that I keep my needles in. More bobbins, more thread, scroll rod sticks. 
storage bags. And you just roll up your stuff and put it in there. Works for diamond paintings too. Seam ripper. I'm always scared to use these on my cross stitch. I'm afraid I'm going to cut the fabric. Oh, that's cute. Anyway, as you can see, oh, I haven't even looked at the crafts. Do it yourself crafts. They have bookmarks, pillowcases, canvas bag. Oh, that popped back up. Cross stitch bookmarks are a new thing for me and I am loving them. The one I'm doing right now is super cute and they're quick and I think I want a bunch of them even though I'm one of those annoying readers that I just remember where I am in a book so I don't use a bookmark for the most part but I do use them in my textbooks because I'm in school right now and I will put one if I have an actual physical textbook I use bookmarks or something to mark my page with. Oh look how cute that one is. And usually they're two-sided, so a lot of times you'll just do the same pattern on both sides. But this one apparently is going to be different than this one. Different on both sides. Pillowcases or pillow covers, some of my favorite things. Even though I find it kind of difficult around the very edge. Because I want to go all the way to the zipper. So I have no canvas showing. Unstitched. But the rest of it, love it. I haven't done any of the totes yet, but look how gorgeous these are. I, if I did one, I'd probably just hang it on my wall because I'd be afraid to use it. Is there some kind of sealer protectant thing you can put over cross stitch? If anybody knows, let me know. Look at this one. I want this one. One of these days, I'm just going to have cross stitch pillowcases all over my house. Oh, that's cute. Love the yin yang dragons. Love it. Oh, look at this cat made out of grass and flowers. The butterfly. I love the little details like that. The little blooms. Stockings. Alice in Wonderland is one of my favorite things. All right, I think that uh, is about everything I can possibly show you. So don't forget, Black Friday, big sale, 20% off with this code, 23 Black Friday 20 Like I said, I'll put it in my description so you'll know it. I'll put a link to the site. Free shipping, anything over $49. They pay all the taxes. It's 7great.com. Everything will be in the description box below, plus some other Black Friday sales and my codes for some of the sites to save an additional percentage off if I have one. Just make sure you look through all the description box, and I thank you very much for joining me today. I know it's a little bit different than my normal video, but I didn't want you to miss out on this sale. It's such a good sale. 20% off. Come on. 20% off and free shipping over $50, well $49, which is better than a lot of the other sites I've seen. So jump on this sale before it's too late. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. <laughs>